Hello everyone, welcome to TechTit.com. In this video, we are going to solve a problem where we have been given an IP address which is 143.27.16.14. Now we have to find out the class to which this IP address belongs. Then we have to find out network ID of this IP address. We also have to find out how many maximum number of hosts can be there in the network to which this IP address belong and we have to find out what is the directed broadcast broadcast address for the network to which it belongs and what is the limited broadcast address. So to start with let's first understand what is directed broadcast and what is limited broadcast. So directed broadcast is sending sending a packet or data to all systems of some network okay so it is how the packet is for this uh, directed broadcast so we have so here we have let's say data then we have source IP so if source IP is 192.168.1.11 then in destination we write the network ID to which we want to send the packet or broadcast the packet so in network I, let's say we have uh, this 4 octet right 4 octet so in first octet we will have network id so let's say we have here 10 and then in host ids as 10 belong to class a right so in host ids we will have 255 255 255 okay so all the host bit All the host bits here it will be one 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 eight ones one 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 right so in this case this packet will be broadcasted to all the hosts in this network okay here we will have network ID if it is a class A right because in class A we use first octet as network ID fine so in case of directed broadcast packet is sent to all systems this is the keyword all systems of some network right now in case of limited broadcast okay so in case of limited broadcast data packet is sent to all systems of own network okay so you have to remember two keywords this is some network Okay, and this is own network so in limited broadcast I'll broadcast to my own network right okay now let's solve the problem so we have been given the IP address as 143.27.16.14 okay now first we need to identify what is the class okay so what is if you remember the class ranges class A range for 1 to 126 then class B ranges from 128 to 191 okay so you can see that and this is about first octet right so the first octet value is coming in between this range so we will say or we know now that this is a class B IP address okay so what will be the class B now in case of class B we know that we use first two octet as NID and remaining two as HID right so what is the network ID here then we have network ID as these two first two octets this one and this one right so we will have network ID as 143 dot 
zero. Now maximum number of hosts in the network. So as we know, we have class B network. This this IP belongs to class B. So to find out maximum number of host, how many bits we have for host here? So we have remaining two, right? Remaining two octet are for host ID. Okay. So how many bits? 8 plus 8, 16 bits, right? So we have 16 bits for host ID and we know that we don't use first one and last one, right? So we will have how many hosts? 2 to the power 16 minus 2, right? So 2 to the power minus 16 minus 2 would be the number of hosts in this network. Now, what would be the directed broadcast address so it means that we need to tell what is the ip address which will be used to broadcast in this network okay so as it is directed we will have network id and then all ones right so network id is 143.27 and then all ones when we when we have all ones in bit then it will be 255.255, right? Now, last one is to find out limited broadcast address. So, limited broadcast address is we are broadcasting into the same network, the network to which this IP address belongs. Yeah, so this is limited broadcast. I forgot to tell you how we uh, declare the packet while doing limited broadcast. So, we do, we write data okay then source and destination part so in source we write source ip address 192.168.1.11 okay and then in destination we write all ones so all 32 bits are one okay so it will be 255.255.255.255 so here the answer would be 255.255 dot 255 dot 255 now the question is whether this will change if IP address changes so as this has to be all ones in case of limited broadcasting so we know that we have to broadcast in my own network so this is the host let's say and this want to broadcast in his own network so it need not to know the destination IP address okay the destination IP address will be all ones okay all 32 bit as one so whether this IP address changes I mean for all IP addresses or for all networks the limited broadcast address would be the same that is all ones okay fine so I hope this is clear if you got any doubt during the explanation just ask your doubt in the doubt section or below in this video in the comment section so see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.